And now, for everyone's favorite game show, it's Two What's and a Wow! To two what's and a wow. Two what's and a wow. The scientific game show that separates the wows from the what? <laughs> the category for today is bones. Mindy, why don't you refresh our contestants on how the game works? You know it. Wowzers, in each of our three rounds today, Guy Raz and I will present you with three scientific statements about bones. But, and this is a Big but. Only one of those statements will be a true scientific wow. The other two, just a couple of made up what? If you guess correctly, you get a point. But if you guess wrong, you gotta stop, drop, and perform a ridiculous physical challenge. Woohoo! Hope everyone boned up on their skeleton facts. Let's get started. Round one. Which of the following statements is a true scientific wow? Is it A, 25% of bones are in your feet? Or is it B, the smallest bone in your body is your tailbone? Or is it C, your teeth are actually bones? When you think you have the correct answer, howl it like a wolf. <laughs> hey, Reggie. <laughs> Cue the thinking music. And time is up. Let's reveal the winning wow. And joining us by phone with the answer is Eleanor from Oregon. Eleanor, what's the wow? My wow is that a quarter of your bones are in your feet. Winner, winner, toenail clippings for dinner! Thank you, Eleanor. If you guessed the answer A, that 25% of bones are in your feet, well, you guessed the winning wow. It turns out that it takes a lot of bones to do everything that feet need to do, from standing upright to dancing on your tiptoes. Humans have 26 bones in each foot. That's a total of 52 bones at the end of your legs. Now, if you did not get the answer correct, you must stop, drop, and yell, I have the stinkiest feet in the world! Okay, round two. Which of the following statements is a true scientific wow? Is it A? Penguin bones are hollow. Or is it B? Sharks have the most bones out of all fish. Or is it C? Giraffes have the same number of neck bones as humans. When you think you have the answer, yell it into the nearest megaphone. <laughs> Reggie, the music, the thinking music. Time is up. It's now time to reveal the winning wow. And with the answer to round two, it's Zoe from Canada. Zoe, tell us, what's the wow? Do you know that giraffes have the same number of neck bones as humans? Isn't that bonker, Bob? Winner, winner, neck ties for dinner! Thank you, Zoe. If you guessed the answer C, that giraffes and humans have the same number of neck bones, you found the winning wow. We humans have seven neck bones or neck vertebrae, and giraffes do too. As you can probably guess, giraffes' neck vertebrae are just a lot bigger, about 10 inches long each. Now, if you did not get the winning wow, 
You must stop, drop, look at the back of your neck and say, wow. Uh, I'm trying, Mindy, but I'm getting kind of dizzy. Oh, just keep spinning, Guy Raz. You'll get it. Whoa. Well, uh, maybe later. Right now, it's time to thank our sponsor. Today's show is brought to you by cartilage? Yes. Cartilage, like bones, but bendier. Do you like the way your ears and the tip of your nose can move when you pull them around? Well, say goodbye to stiff and flexible bones and replace them with cartilage. But Mindy, I like my bones the way they are. Suit yourself, Guy Raz. I'm gonna be as flappy as a stingray. Well, uh, okay, uh, let's move on to round three. Which of the following statements is a true scientific wow? Is it A, snake bones are bright blue? Or is it B, babies have 100 more bones than grown-ups? Or is it C, centipedes have a hard shell on the outside and a skeleton on the inside? When you think you know, turn your hand into a puppet and make it say the answer. <laughs> hey, Reggie! Cue the thinking music. And time is up. Let's reveal the winning wow. <laughs> Calling in with the correct answer to this round, it's Frankie from New York. Frankie, what's the wow? My wow in the world is babies have a hundred more bones than grown nuts. Winner, winner, baby food for dinner! Thank you, Frankie. If you guess the answer B, that babies have 100 more bones than grown ups, well, congratulations! You found the winning wow! Human babies have about 300 bones and pieces of cartilage. As they grow, some bones fuse together to make bigger bones. And by the time they're grown up, most humans have 206 bones, almost 100 less than when they were born. Now, if you did not get that answer correct, you must stop, drop, and dance like a skeleton. <gasps> and that can mean only one thing. It's time for today's Bonker Balls bonus round. And the question for this round is, what is Guy Raz making me for lunch? Wait, I'm making you lunch? Yeah, it could be a sandwich or a salad or a bowl of barbecue sauce. I'm not picky. <sighs> Mindy, did you forget your lunch on the kitchen counter today? No. I left my lunch on the kitchen counter three days ago, and now it's covered in ants. Uh, well, uh, congratulations to all of our winning wowzers on today's show. All of our contestants today will be leaving with a fabulous invisible prize. Reggie, why don't you roll our prize generator out here onto the stage? Wait, are those my car tires? Uh, no. I invented this machine to generate a fabulous prize for everyone playing. It spits out your prize in three different parts every time. Yeah, but each part is horrible, except my tires. Uh, can I get those back? No, you can't, Guy Raz. We're riding home in the prize generator after the show because my ice cream truck is in the shop that I drove through the window of when the brakes gave out last week. What? Ready to power this baby up, Reg? <laughs> All of our contestants today will be taking home their very own invisible, moldy, grandma socks! Everyone gets a pair of socks that have been on a grandma for so long that they grew spores. Wait, uh, who's grandma? Did somebody call my name? Uh, <laughs> well, uh, contestants, um, that's all the time we have for today. But before we go, we have a little steam-themed at-home challenge for you. We call it Skeleton Search. 
For this challenge, we want you to notice all the bones in your body. Feel the bones in your arms, head, spine, and everywhere else. And see if you can tell where one bone ends and the next one begins. And don't forget to take a photo or video or an x-ray. Grown-ups, you can upload photos and videos to us at tinkercast.com slash share. And be sure to come back on Monday for a brand new episode of Wow in the World. And again on Friday for a new episode of Two What's and a Wow. Until then, keep on wow.